And we're live. And timed. And timed. Hi, everyone. I am Nick. And I'm Maria. And welcome to Full, Full of, of Brick. Number 78. We should say it together. Full oh. of 23. Today is October 23, 2016. My goodness. You are so old. And this whole week was my live stream comeback week. Meaning you weren't so busy, huh? I live streamed on Monday with Harold. Mm -hmm. A warm up for our Tuesday live stream of the winner of the Disney Castle. And then I live stream on Friday. Friday. No, it just meant I had less Poke Run hunts. Pokemon oh, hunts. Oh, so it's because it was cold, right? Or wet and it rainy. It was rainy. And so you can't really pull out your phone. Yeah. So I didn't poke. I only Poke ran uh, once on Monday with Tristan. I didn't Poke Run at all. And then this I didn't week. Poke Run after that. And then Tuesday. We ran inside because it was raining, and so I didn't Pokemon at all on Tuesday. Wednesday, I Wednesday I didn't Poke run at all too, and Thursday I didn't Poke run at all. However, then, when I came back from the gym today, you just went out for a quick yeah. Poke run. And Friday I Poke ran with Tristan in the morning, but I didn't Poke run after that. So only two Poke runs in the whole week. Yesterday I didn't Poke run. And here I am buying two extra G's, yo. And today. Um, I didn't run with Tristan in the morning because he has his cross country meet tomorrow. Yeah. However, after the live stream on, I was on the live stream today as well with uh, Ozzy. Mm -hmm. I pokey ran just a little bit. Okay. So. Well, part of the pokey run too, that it's getting colder, is you're saying it's so hard for you to just run and have it's getting cold. Right? I was Your talking to Andrea from Port City Bricks, yes. and she has these special gloves from Nike. So I did look at them up. They actually didn't have them at Nike. Nike got dot com. Oh. But I saw them in Sport Check and in Sporting Life. How much are they? They're thirty-five dollars each. And they have tip. They and they have, have rubber tips. tips. So I'm how gonna, does that work? I thought it still has to be I our think hands. Maybe, maybe it's just it maybe feels like this, like the. It feels like the a fake hand. Houndsfield unit or the density, uh. whatever. In any case, it's thirty-five dollars. I'll get you one because actually Sporting Life. Should get Life, Tristan one too. I'm gonna get one for Tristan, but a cheaper version. Yeah. Like I don't want to give him because this one's like those high-tech ones. I okay. feel like Tristan overheats anyways. That he may just do this and toss it. But he'll only use it whenever he pokey runs. I know. But no, there's already enough like gloves. With but me. there's some gloves that I've seen that are just like that, you know, the material of the stretchy material. Oh, okay. So it's not like a super high tech running in the winters. I know he will, but I don't, I don't think he'll really use them. I don't know. We'll see. But the Lululemon versions are a little bit cheaper. Sporting Life gift card from them again. So I was going to apply. So yeah, I pokey ran on, I mean, I live streamed on Monday, Tuesday, Friday, yesterday, and this morning, five days, five times in seven days. I didn't live stream. So it was like this a, this is me live streaming. It was right a now. live stream comment. Oh, then last Sunday too. So that's six times in eight days. So I'm, I'm live streamed out. Good. So this whole week, no live streaming again. I well, don't know. Harold and I have to finish the castle. Yeah. Why is it taking so long? It's a long build. It's Andrea 14 bags. Andrea finished it? Yeah, but she, Andrea's fast. Andrea's efficient? Or you guys, maybe you guys are really relishing the build. We're chit-chatting. You're like relishing. You're like, oh, do you have this piece? Okay, let's put it now at together. Notice how since I've been doing a lot of live streams, we've been mentioning Harold's name a lot. Harold's Just back? Stream, Harold's back. No one wants to watch us. No, because everyone is, are sick of me because they've been see, watching oh me on gosh, live streams. I know. Eight times. Too much of a face six, reveal. Six times in eight days. Too much of a face reveal. Okay, so what happened this week? It's been a um, little bit nuts. Every single week is nuts, and it just got busier and busier and busier. I want to say, uh, last last Sunday we went for Tristan's friend's birthday party. So it was at Palladium. I yes. think we alluded to this. And Tristan was one of two boys. Oh yeah, we talked about it last time. One of two boys only invited to this pretty much all girl. How many girls were there? Well, there was only 12. Usually like a lot of party packages out there is only, so it's you're only inviting 12 kids, right? Unless you're oh, inviting maximum. Oh, but there were maximum. two boys that were not from the class. Yes, I think so. So there were eight girls and four, and four boys. boys. I'm sure, yes. But I feel like, so I'm like, Tristan, you're really close to these people? Oh no. The girl's <laughs> not even in his class. I don't know. Yeah. Um, in any case, her mom was cute. Uh, she's Filipino. I always get a thrill when I'm a taller Filipino, and I am so short. We have For those of you who have seen me in live person, you know I am so short. But there are shorter people out there than me. I'm thrilled every time I see people's tops of the head who aren't children. We have a feeling that don't there was a girl there who wanted the celebrant 
to invite Tristan. Because, you know, you've all been grade seven girls. Like, grade seven boys are pretty like, oh, she's my buddy. We're just friends. La, 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 la. But girls are like, hmm, how can I manipulate this birthday party so that I can see the love of my life for like two hours on Sunday out of school? Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we dropped him off. And it's funny, when we dropped him off, I didn't realize he might have been embarrassed, but we dropped him off as Our a- sons capable of embarrassment? As a family. Yeah, we dropped, it was me and daddy, and then two other babies. This is our firstborn. This is his very first birthday party he's been invited to. Not, but. And all the tween girls were there just like, well, how come he's bringing his whole family with us? Hey, brother from another brick. Hey, brother from another brick. Wow, that's, thank you for the compliments. It's only been <laughs> five minutes. Thank you. So, um, yeah, he didn't look embarrassed though, but. The whole clan. Maybe was you there. would have been embarrassed. Would you have been embarrassed? I would like, yay! This is my mom and my daddy. And your brother. Two but I don't brothers. have any brothers, so I wish. Look, everybody! This is my clan. Don't mess with me. So we dropped them off, and we went. Which is what I was trying to convey to them. This is his clan. Uh, don't mess with him. Don't mess with me. Oh, don't mess with you. <laughs> don't mess with the mom. So um, we went for lunch at Scarabouche. Yes. So it's that Italian. was my first time. That was not my first time. But the thing I like about Scatabouche, it used to be Alice Fazuli's. Um, and this is like an Italian Scatabouche. I don't know who it's owned by. But it's not very, very Italian. Like every time I go to an Italian restaurant, I'm always looking for lasagna. Yeah. And they don't have that on their list. I mean, hello. They have, they have spaghetti, spaghetti, and meatballs, spaghetti and meatballs. So I'll try it next time. Spaghetti and meatballs is my go to whenever we go to a destination um, race for, race well, for carb loading the yes. day before. I always look for spaghetti and meatballs. So what their two famous scatabouches, we make our pasta fresh every day and they also make their mozzarella cheese fresh every day. Yeah. So we didn't have pasta. So I feel like, you know, there's a server who's telling us all of the wonderful things that they have. And we're like, we're not here for pasta. And we shot him down and he hated us for the rest of the- I said, time. I want the butcher pizza. So they do have these pizzas, but not circular pizzas. It's more hey, like- Hey, Port a City Bricks. Isn't the goal of being a parent is a chance to yes! embarrass their children? Yes, and I love it. Like I don't think my parents ever did that much to me. They didn't, or they didn't know. But if you can intentionally do it, that's like even more of like a ten pointer, <laughs> right? Like yes, but he doesn't embarrass so easily, or he hides it very well. I or... think Mason would be the one who would be more embarrassed, just his personality. No, I mom, think, don't come with I me. I think part of it is what you don't want your mom to like kiss you ever. Yeah. When I'm dead, no one's gonna kiss you. You're gonna guilt is my yeah for sure. Guilt trip them. I think that's another whole like idealism of being a parent to guilt trip. If there is mom guilt, there better be a lot of children guilt. Yeah. Is what I'm saying. Don't you feel child guilt? No, he doesn't. So I ordered the butcher pizza, which was um, pepperoni, what? Italian sausage, ground beef, on roasted on or roasted roasted onions, or roasted peppers, probably both. Both. <laughs> And but the cool thing was instead of having it already pre-cut, bless him. That's bless how me. he sneezes. Just it's a nice quiet sneeze. Mine is like all bricks. No more bricks. So instead of um, instead of it pre-cut already, they gave us these scissors. Pieces of scissors. We've pizza never seen scissors. pieces of scissors. And I think Harold was telling. I was telling Harold that he's like, I always cut my pizza with scissors. But they're like shears. They like open this way, right? <laughs> Anyhow, I thought that was cool because every time I go to Skedabouche, I am absolutely obsessed with. with their tomato soup. It is the most delicious, savory, full, wholehearted tomato soup. I, I don't know how to make tomato soup, but it is full on tomato. tomato delicious soup. with like this bread in the middle. That's delicious. So that's what I, I always go to, which like, what? You're only having soup here? But you've only been there one other time. No. Oh, all these secret Skedabouche. Kedabush, kedabush. I've had the lobster linguine. That was okay. How many times have you been to Skadabush? It's just me and Crystal. Hey, we're gonna go out. Or we're gonna go to Skadabush. Oh. Um, maybe maybe know. a handful of times. Not like crazy ridiculous. That's because... five times. Including you now. Six. No, like five times including you. We also had this thing, it was a mozzarella blob. Yes, it's a they're fresh mozzarella, so they give it to you in a block, a wood block, and you have uh, some delicious bread. And then a little, a little bit of jam and then salt, like sea salt. Sea and then salt. you have to like cut it. Was, the... It's not jam. It was like. Um, it was savory. It wasn't sweet, right? It wasn't too sweet. What's the stuff you put on nachos? It was like salsa. salsa. It was like salsa. But a little bit sweeter than salsa. Uh. But not as sweet as jam. 
And so the the mozzarella blog. Yes, an inside out of bread bowl. That's exactly what it is. Stop talking Panera bread. <laughs> so the mozzarella. I know Panera bread also has good tomato soup. The mozzarella blob was tasteless. However, it had texture. And so you, once, would, you would cut it, and then you put it on the bread, and you put the sea salt on top. And when you put the salt, top, all these amazing like and then you flavor, which is called I never the had salt something flavor. like that. So good. Actually, it reminded me of whenever you go to Italian wedding, and they have the antipasta. Yeah. And you, I'd make sandwiches and put like minus the deli and, and minus yeah. the vegetables. And then I also had a Mini side order of polenta, and then our our uh, oh, yeah, server tricked me. He's like, oh, the, sir, the size is so tiny. And I don't know. I thought the, the huge thing was also tiny. So but... polenta is what? Potato. Is it potato? Rice. But it's deep fried. Deep fried. It's, it's like a tiny little ball. So I only tiny, like it's it. It's like tots. Yes. Tater tots. tots. I only like it because when I went to Jamie Olivier, they had one. And I actually prefer them. But I also recommended Jamie Olivier to Sue Trong and friends. And they didn't like it. Mm. I said you have to have the polenta tots, um, but and then what else? And then the kids had pizza, so they were good. So after our meal, it was maybe like an hour. We mm -hmm. went back to Palladium because we wanted to helicopter and spy on Tristan. But then I felt awkward looking for my son. We're looking everywhere. We're like, where is he? We and I feel like him. he sees us, and he's like running away from us. And then we finally found him at one of the games with. So the part girl. of their birthday party is they do get a card, and I haven't been to Palladium in a long time, but it's like a big person's. Um, it's like Chuck, Chuck, e. Cheese, Chuck e. Cheese for right? adult. Or so for you play games teenagers. and you get tickets, but now you have just this car that you fill in with cash, and then when you win whatever, it automatically goes back to that credit. So yeah. I feel like each is already designated a certain amount of credit. No, it can't be because sometimes you get a lot of credit. It's just, it's smart. Yeah. Like you scan it and everything. So And then you get toys as well. Oh, cornmeal. Polenta. So yeah. we, um, we spotted Tristan at this game where you have to throw footballs through this little hoop, and he was with... Not me. He was with the girl. The girl we always tease him about. The girl is sweet. She's, she's Filipino as well. She's small. And then, but she's smart. You said you're saying. Right? I don't know. She may look smart. I don't know. <laughs> Have I seen her report card? So uh, Mason went running. Tristan, Tristan. And so we were asking Tristan, so how things are? How are things going? And then we looked around. We're terrible. Then he's gone. So there, she was gone. Yeah, she's like, oh my god, parents! Ah! So we scared her off. But Tristan was just like nonchalant about it. He's just my buddy. And then I spotted them together again later on, and, and they like, asked Daddy, me, "Can we go to a uh, go karting, which is an additional expense to the cars that you get? Like you can't just swipe your car for that." Hey Kelly. So here is Nick facilitating my kids' kind of pseudo <laughs> first date. It was, they, no, because it was just the two of them. So the rest of the parties everywhere else. Yeah, they, this big so we went dark outside. Arcade thing. It was five. Hey, Kelly. It was five dollars each for them to go once around the go kart course. And oh, but you know, our kid being the anti Romeo that apparently <laughs> on Monday morning told her, Hey, you owe me five bucks now. <laughs> yeah, anti Romeo. See, this is how girls and get And here's another you. anti Romeo. So, <laughs> well, when they were going up to the front of the line, the guy was like, So, have you guys done this before? And she's like, Yeah, I, I've done this before. Even though it's like uh, ages 11, 11 and up. Done this where before? I don't know. He says he did it with um, Kaylin before. But then I don't think the guy believed them, so he was like, "Okay, oh, I'll, maybe he did." Kaylin's dad used to take them to play them. So that, I'll explain to you, to you guys how to do the go karts. And so they had the, they fitted their helmets and everything. And so Tristan was in the front car, and then um, the her was in the car behind. And so uh, he got Tristan's ready. They, I guess for the go karts you have to pull. It's like a starting a lawnmower. Oh, like or a woody pull. Back. So you pull it, and then so he started. Tristan didn't even wait for her. She just like, see ya. And he just went <laughs> the Romeo that he is. And this, I am happy. And then she went chasing Knowing after that he him. doesn't like her. Yeah, he's just like, oh. Those do, 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 great do. seven boys that just break our hearts. <laughs> While she was like following around. When, where is he? She's, Anyways. Older, she's older than him too. Because they were saying how old. She, so he said he was 11. She said she was 12. Well, he's like the youngest in his class. It's like yeah. him and then Adrian. So, but, so anybody was, would be older than him. That was funny. I'm older than you. And then uh, <laughs> afterwards, I guess it's like Chuck E. Cheese, so you can redeem how many tickets you get. Yes. And so Mason got farting putty. I love it. It's like putty. I hate putty. Putty in a toilet bowl toy, and then you put your fingers in, and it makes farting noises. Yeah, fun. <laughs> what did Tristan get? He got, he got that funny ball. And you know what he did with it? No. 
He cut it. He filled it with water. Oh, look, it's a water ball. And then that's it. And it's what cut. A funny so, ball. And it's like a stress ball. Like you squeeze it. Oh. And it has all these tentacles, but it's a soft tentacle ball. And you can just squeeze, 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 squeeze it. Instead, he's like, hmm, I wonder what's inside. He cuts it, realizes it's air. I threw it out. Mason here. was about to get the finger lock. And it freaked okay. him out. Yeah, there's this toy where you put your fingers together. <laughs> what's wrong? Are you getting allergies? I don't know. I'm sneezing. I have Advil cold and sinus. I don't feel sick. Yeah, yeah it has. Sick either. It has. You put your fingers it's in. It's like a cylinder. You put your fingers in, but the more you try to pull away from each other, it tightens. Yeah. So it's like you finger locked yourself, but really the trick is you have to put push your fingers together so it gets fatter, and then you slowly ease your finger out. Anyways, he was about to cry because you could see he was starting to tear I'm up. like, oh my god, this is like a handcuff thing, only finger cuffs. So yeah. we didn't get that. I'm like, nope, you're gonna the Chinese finger trap. There you go. Yeah, finger trap. We That's didn't know funny. that. I didn't know it was Chinese. Or. <laughs> did so, I say hey, hey pumpkin? Hola, and then after that, where did we go? After his after his birthday? Yeah, we just teased him. I think we just went home. home. We probably went around to like Loblaws and stuff. Oh yeah, we did all those things. Those yeah. regular mundane. I gotta get. So the next, so the next day, um, I asked Tristan. So mm -hmm. were people talking about the um, the birthday party? And he was like. Uh yeah, we went to. I was invited to this um, youth ambassador or faith ambassador. The they get you in with a birthday party. And the following is like, hey, the faith ambassadors at school at lunchtime. He's like, I was just a guest, but I came to the faith ambassadors. I'm like, who was at the faith ambassadors? And then he starts naming all the girls who are at the party. So they're probably like, Tristan, you want to come with us to the faith ambassadors? Okay. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm like, you didn't try for volleyball. It's okay, mom. I already have running and a basketball. But I'll try out for flag football. Flag football. Yeah, I bet you they're trying out for flag football too. Because now he wants to try out for the school play. Like, where's this coming from, the school play? I know. And he's so angry at me because like, I don't know where my forms are. I'm like, I signed those forms. And in the school play, that's actually going to be a production next spring. Oh. So all throughout, it's a big production. It's, it's, I think it's any. Practicing it's practicing throughout the whole. It's practicing, yes. So this year into next year, yes, all practices? Yes. And he's going to have a non speaking part. He wants a non speaking part, but you have to still. See, I, I bet you I know what happened. You so do. the girl was like, So, Tristan, are you going to join the school play? He's like, uh, yeah. Sure. Yeah. So after he said, Sure, he went and looked at the list non speaking, non speaking, yeah, non speaking. Non speaking. Because I'm like, You still have to try out. You, yeah. Are you going to be part of the chorus? Like, you have to still sing. So. And then there's other jobs too. But it's such a commitment because it's like, Are you able to stay in school till 4 30? Which is good. Like I lived in school. Didn't you live in school when we were little? Yeah, but with sports, not school plays. Mine was school plays. I did all the sets. Yeah, you were the set decorator. I was set, a set designer. Set designer. Because you are the artist. Mm. But uh, yeah, we don't know where that's happening. In any case, he has had a couple of really good tests the last few weeks, did too. But basketball is getting so basketball y. Yeah. I have no words. So now his practices are Monday nights from six to eight and then he has a double practice on thursday from six to eight and then eight thirty to ten thirty so the one from six thirty to eight thirty it's with his age group and some younger kids mm -hmm. and then from eight thirty to ten thirty it's basically from the with the older kids so the kids one two and three years older than him mm -hmm. and um this past thursday the the earlier practice it seemed to be more working on ball handling skills, working on form shooting, stuff like that. And then the actual, the one, the later practice actually worked on plays. So like learning how to um, follow plays, form formations. formations on the court, uh, zone defense, man-to-man -man defense, mm -hmm. stuff that I, c I couldn't teach him. Like I could practice with him the ball handling drills and the form shooting, but doing all the plays. So that was good mm -hmm. that he was exposed to that. Because I wasn't really exposed Are to that. Are you more excited than him still? I wasn't exposed to that stuff till grade nine, till high school. Yeah. Because in elementary school, we weren't doing plays. No, and... but this is the thing, right? Like more and more parents and more and more kids are exposed like to like more parents. Yeah. So us included now. But even for kids, because he said there's a kid with 2009. Yeah, there was a 2009. They're putting kid. their kids into these things. So by the time they're in grade, grade high schools, they're super pros already, yeah. right? So it's like, it's even like Tristan not making basketball last, last year. year because there's a number of them who are probably in something like this or they're just more keen. Yeah. And I don't know, if he doesn't make basketball, are you going to whip him? Why would I whip him? <laughs> but um, he was, um, 
even though he had two practices, the second practice, he was still beating people up and down the court. It wasn't like he was tired or so anything. So cardio is good. His, cardio, been... his cardio is really good. It's just his skill-wise. Is he still, like, awkward? No, he's better. Oh, good. He's better now. Does he like it? Or is it the answer that he don't He's know? actually talking to the other kids now and making jokes with them. So he's Yeah, but he's talking anime with them. That's what well, he still, me. it's it's uh, bonding yeah. with teammates. Yeah, well, you know what? That's what my cousin said. Like, anything, Whereas right? before, he would just ignore them, and they would ignore him. And they wouldn't even pass him the ball. But now they're passing him the ball because... I guess they. You like anime? They Just know him pass. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I mean, that's good, I guess. But Thursday was crazy because it was like a four hour practice session, which, if he's having fun, I feel like I need to feed my boy more. He eats enough. <clears throat> um, what happened Friday? This previous Friday, I had a sense party. Oh, tell them about your smelly party. <laughs> So, your pyramid scheme. Yeah, it's not my pyramid scheme. You so didn't drink the Kool-Aid, though. I drank some tea. Oh, uh oh. It's okay. okay. So there's a girl at work, and there's actually a couple of them. I didn't know, but anyways, this girl at work, she newly started uh, her side business, I guess is what we'll call it. I mean, she's a therapist Pyra like me. But pyramid was, scheme. It's on the side. I know. We're, we're so wary of pyramid schemes, owning a business, because so many people approach us to like have all these different like isogenics or USANA or all these like different just... Yeah. products that would help our wellness center right but we're like yeah i don't know anyways her wellness or her i'm not gonna call it like that anymore <laughs> is uh doTERRA which is essential oils yeah so it's actually a nice brand like you know all of these brands are gonna say we're natural but not many people know about us because we're expensive but other people who own um shares in us are with these billionaires millionaires like she said she's gone to a lot of these conferences and they're all gorgeous people gorgeous women basically the same kind of meetings that you saw in yes a, was... so the thing though is all of these gorgeous women are probably like stay-at-home rich women who are like oh I'm, I'm gonna have a business on the side and have all my rich friends buy them so they're already good looking to begin with because they take care of themselves right off the bat and then they have this which is doTERRA an essential man so you can actually google it um but you do need Someone. So if I sm if I start smelling these, I'm gonna become beautiful. Uh, no, there's different ones. So something about uh -huh. healthy, something about invigorating. So there's like peppermint. If like I we use what's that thing again? When our throats hurt, there's a drop that I give. Uh, uh it's an herb. Mm. It's a very concentrated herb, but it helps, right? So orange juice or orange juice. But like when I have an upset tummy, I will have peppermint tea. So they actually have peppermint, which you can rub or lavender for sleep. So they have all these array of different things. And sometimes they have blend scents. So something like uh, if you want to be like invigorated. It sounds like they hooked you. Uh, I'm just a good salesperson. <laughs> like really, like she wasn't. I'm even better than her. Oh. She just doesn't know it. Yeah. I just don't like to push these things on people. Like yeah. if I like it, I will buy a lot of it which I won't. <laughs> oh, but but uh, there was actually a door prize and I won the door prize, which is oh. great. She hated me for it. So I don't know if she ever will watch this. Well, you, you weren't even invited. So were you? yeah, you so invited I, yourself. To I kind of did. <laughs> so uh, we all have different treatment units and I'm actually in the same treatment unit as her, but I don't work on the same cycle as she does. Yeah. Uh, but I saw through the shoulder of one of my friends that I work with on the same cycle. I'm like, Hey, what's this smelling party? Because I'm like that. I'm like, what party? I'm the party, party, party. And so I, my other friends like, Oh, come, she won't mind. So I kind of, kind of invited myself, but it's because of that other friend, but I was able to hook another friend in. So really I'm a sales pitcher for this already. Yeah, but did they, they didn't like it. Right? Huh? They didn't like it. They just came for the free food. Yeah, I don't know. Mm. It wasn't really much of a free food, really. Um, Harold says, You are beautiful no matter what they say. Thanks, that, Harold. That's a song. Thanks, Harold. What song is that? Can you sing it for us? Uh, he says, Actually, the last pyramid party I went had some pretty good food. Mine was okay. Mine was just like hot water. <laughs> <laughs> it should be really like if you're a sales pitching right you should really draw people in and like put more of an investment out but she's a little bit of um standoff frugal. yeah frugal frugal with. anyhow so the um when i won the door prize there's only four of us who ended up going out of six and at first how we, many people were at the party four oh no i mean not of you guys but how many party were how many people were at the party four. Oh. It's not a big party. And, and you knew everyone at the party. They're all co-workers from my oh, unit. I thought it was like a lot of other no, people No, she's been to a conference where there's a lot of people, oh, okay. like in different cities, to, to you know, it's like So motivate. you only had a one in four chance of winning the door I prize. I know. 
but she didn't like the fact that I won because apparently I win a lot of stuff from work. <laughs> I do. Yeah. Okay. Which isn't bad. Win the 50-50. I do. Okay. Is, is the story done? <laughs> uh, the story is done. But I did like the oil that I... Yeah, I, I smelt it. It didn't smell so good. It's, it's citrusy. It, it felt invigorated. I didn't I feel know. I didn't feel beautiful after smelling it. I don't think... Well, Harold says you're beautiful no matter what. Thanks. Um, Saturday, yesterday was our 3K prediction run. Yes. And uh, Tristan was in it once again. Yes. Like oh, for those of you... Uh, since I always say it, so for those of you who don't know what our 3K prediction run is, every month we do a race at the clinic where people have to guess how fast they can run or walk the three kilometer distance. The person whose guess is closest to their actual time is the winner. And so we've been doing it. This I was counting. So we do, we do it every month. This was the sixth, the sixth year was in August. So that's 66 because we don't do it in December. So 11 times six. Plus, we didn't do that one February, so that's 65. Plus two months is 67. So this was our 67. Did, was that kind of complicated? I, I, I followed through. I'm, yeah. I'm fast like that. So uh, it was it was a nice, cool day. So I thought Tristan was going to uh, do really cold. well. But it's, I like running better when it's cold. If you had, if I had taken a video of how he was the last stretch, he was he like an airplane. Even, oh, he was fooling around? Because his time was 12 Because there's no Steve. There's no one to like yeah. egg him, right? He, I All I told him, because I this is me talking to him now, right? Because I'm like, do not be in the same piece as someone. Look at everybody's time. You are currently the fastest. You have to be ahead of them. Yeah. That's what I told so him. So he looked, oh, I'm ahead of those guys. And like an airplane. <laughs> so his time was 1230. He predicted 1155. So he was way off. 11.55 is his fastest. And it was on a hot day, too. But he was running with someone yes. who was fast. Ow! So we'll see how he does. Break. We'll see how he does tomorrow at the actual And I told him tomorrow, race. too. Try to be in the first half of the pack. Yeah. And then just pick them up one by one. And I get I, I get it. Like, he doesn't know how the the other fastest are. Well, he knows Christian. And Christian's going to... Yeah, stick with Christian. So I just stick with Christian. Because yeah. Christian came in second. But in the this last is a week, longer mileage tomorrow. Which might be to his advantage. Because he's longer mileage. Because he's a longer further out. Yeah, he's used to doing sixteen kilometers, eight yes. kilometers. And then tomorrow has basketball too, right? So, um, because there's only four kids who made it from his school. We have to drive them. Yeah, we have to drive him as parents. Um, I think for flexibility. After the three K prediction run, I wanted to do the make and take, but I can only bring Tristan because Mason had skating. So busy. My Saturdays are so busy. So, so the make and take was from eleven uh. to one. However, we didn't get to leave the clinic till like 11.45 and there was tons of traffic. So that by the time we got to the make and take, it was like 12.15. Mm -hmm. And we got there and they had the wrong... So they, this is one location. They had Toys the wrong Rest. set at the Toys Crazy. R Us. They were supposed to have either a mini airport that you can build or a Lego Friends lemonade stand. And what they had mini was... airport sounds weird. Like how big is this? If I had a picture, I, I, I have a picture there. Oh, okay. Um, hey, girl in her bricks. And so what they had was the same build they had last week, was, yes. which was the Nexo Knight Monster. Yes. So Tristan just got the pieces for that. He didn't bother building it there. Yes. And so we quickly got in our car to drive, kind of drive to the next Toys R Us to try to make, their, make yes. it in time because it closed at 1 because it goes from 11 to 1. And so we were able to get there at 12.45. We're like, oh, good, 15 minutes. So we get there, and they're already packing up. They didn't even wait to... What? Well, they gave us free, bi free bricks, but... Yeah. You still couldn't build. Uh, it was like a, a mashup of the mini, the micro airport and the lemonade stand. Mm. So it's free bricks. And they all just went into That's my park good. spin. I but, took Mason skating in the meantime and got to his regular class, which is fine. But he kept on falling yesterday. And part of it is his helmet was so tight. Oh, it so wasn't I tight when I I know. So I don't think I, I don't know how to put it in. I think I have to stretch it out and put it in. But maybe I'm not strong enough. I, I don't know. I didn't and I think do I'm any, strong enough. I didn't do anything special. But he's like, it was hurting like here. Maybe so his head I grew. just need to, I don't know. So it was kind of, he fell a lot. Like, And he wears like black snow pants. Well, you thought so he, he all this ice fell here. because his helmet was too tight? Well, that's what, well, I don't know. He said I thought he fell because he's on, he's on skates. I mean, he fell because he's on skates, but maybe the pain of the helmet is making him not concentrate well on. Did he have to skate backwards again? Yeah. Okay. And then he went around there around the rink. So, I mean, I mean, he's improved a lot. Like just because it's like the fourth, you know, whatever. And then uh, after that, after that, the boys, two of the boys that I have, which is Hayden and Mason, they just fell asleep in the car. 
but the whole time like i always have snacks for them right because i know like we're not going to be able to like stop off anywhere i was contemplating about buying them pizza but the last time that happened they made such a mess mm. so i just had like all these like little snacks everywhere but they fell asleep that between skating and basketball for mason i actually have two hours an hour and a half i just left them in the car that's okay right in the driveway windows are open cool cool day I kept them peeking out to see if the neighbors are going to report me to the police. They're going to be all sweaty after. But they were fine because, but it was cold. Here's Amy. Here's a tip: you can leave your baby in the car. Well, one is seven, and the other is in diapers. So if there's going to be no. Anyways, I was able to cook, and I was able to clean the house and pee. Look, they're going to call child services. Go nice. call child services. Take my children away from me. <laughs> More Lego for us. More Lego for me. Put me in jail. I can't read twenty four seven. Um. What else? Unless. Yeah. And then uh, yesterday I also had to register Tristan for confirmation. Oh yeah. So after basketball, I thought the confirmation same... was grade eight. It's grade seven. Or is that reconciliation? I don't know. What is reconciliation? Is it, what's, what's the one where you have to wear the robe with the name? That was grade eight, not grade seven. It's now grade seven. Oh. It was grade eight when we were little. It's when did they, now when did they change seven. it? I don't know. So at one point there's a cohort that would be dual, right? Because the grade eight and the grade seven would be like one particular year. It's yeah. like when they got rid of OAC, there would be two graduating yeah. classes. What name did he pick? I don't think Because I don't there think yet. Tristan's uh, I, he is choose Nicholas. Same... What did you choose? Did you choose Nicholas? I chose Gerald. <laughs> did I say Gerald? Yeah. That's what it says on my thing. I think I just chose Andrea. St. Nicholas is Santa. I know. Isn't that cute? Yeah, I guess. So in any case, um, we also need a sponsor. So for all of you them. You picked Andrea? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's my middle name. But there's a St. Maria. Three. Why did you pick that? Mm. Okay. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Uh, and then you have to pick a sponsor, but I thought for simplicity's sake, I just asked Una. Okay. He doesn't know any sponsors. He wanted you. I'm See, look, Harold says, yeah, I thought it was grade eight. Yeah, so grade seven now. Your kid will have confirmation in grade seven unless US laws are still different. Is there a Saint Harold? Mm, Harold will be the first hark, one. Hark the Herald Angels Sing. That's Harold, H E R A L D, like to bring on. Uh, mine was St. Peter. Ooh. You were Harold Peter or Peter Pad Harold? Pedro. Pedro. Pedro is the Filipino. He said St. Peter. I know, but it, his nick, his middle name is probably Pedro. It's Harold Pedro Ramos. It's Peter, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so I did a confirmation. Oh, I'm going to get Tristan's mock. And then somebody told me. Oh, I'm doing a live stream hosting tonight. So, uh, are you guys gonna be home? Meaning, don't be home because then you guys are gonna be on the on the internet. So, I decided to have a secret dinner with the boys at Moxie's, which even until now, since I'm just here by myself, Nick doesn't even know. So, we we're able to order our favorite nachos. And yesterday, I tried some Greek feta wrap, which was delicious. My mom had her salmon, and the two other boys had pizza. And I went to Square One to also returned my old navy pants i bought a bunch of pants for the boys and the quality is just yay minifig collector said now for the second time that he made a heaven mock i know i saw it yesterday cool okay so this is our mock this is in this isn't our mock this is this is mock. collectively our mock because we bought the bricks so um this is actually the case of the sword do you know how to take the sword out i do uh, I thought I thought you didn't know. There's a clip. It took me a while to figure it out. It's not a clip. It's just the studs here. I know, but here. it's just like it's clipped in. I was telling him he needed to like put like to tile it up. To tile. You're this. the one who gave him that idea. I was like, listen, no, you're gonna waste all it, my tiles. Listen, tile it up in like a trans clear. So when you pull it out, it's like it's like glowing, like you know, like um. Oh, Hobbit. you can use my trans. I have a bunch of trans. There you go. Thing. I think then it like but like trans sure. blue or like trans like a different like, so it's like a glue but then it won't fit anymore this perfect sheet yeah uh oh did we break it uh oh the piece came off when I got it from him upstairs I said he said please don't break it this is Harold by the power of grace go Harold knows that I'm I'm uh, known for breaking Tristan's oh what is this piece I don't know I don't know I don't know oh my god. There's a missing piece. He won't notice. Maybe that's how it clicks in. I can't even put it back in. Child safety lock. 
I think this it is be a child safety. A fall, I think it's a mom safety lock. A fall safety lock. It locks still, but we, now there's an extra one by two yes. that came off. It's like a discount version now because now Let's we can save it. this Let's one by two. There, you won't know. You'll be like, "What is this doing there?" Oh, that's. There we if, go. If I take something out of your Ferris wheel, whatever, and, and put it somewhere else, would you, you do? When you take your Instagram photos, I come back. I'm like, "Hey, someone's." I been do not do that. That was Hayden. Someone's been sleeping in my bed. Someone's been sitting in my chair, and it broke. Where's that from? Goldilocks. Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Wait. So yesterday. Oh, the tip. Carol said it's from the tip. How does he know? Did he see it fall? Did he rewind the video and then no, go it's slow? Not. In? It's not from the tip. The tip's here. Maybe there's an additional tip. I don't see it. See, look. Why does he use two one by ones here when he could just use a one by two? He's like wasting all the one by ones. Yeah, you talk to him. That's why I tell him that. And like all like he uses two he uses a bunch of two by fours when he could just use a long brick. He's not thinking. He's grade seven. He just grabs and grabs instead of just using the long ones. All the micro stuff that I by the power of grayscale. What did Shira say? Shira said by the, by the grace of grayscale? No. Did she say grayscale? I don't know. They don't know Shira. You know Shira. They don't know Shira. So this is uh Tristan's mock. He said he wants to bring it to school where he's going to be to suspended Philly. for bringing weapons. A weapon. You think it's going to be in touch for until Philly? There's a uh, whole lot of bricks. Oh, Hi, baby. Oh, what do you want? Oh, I understand your English. Oh, Come down. Tell me. Oh, I Here's, will want your what? Oh, Here's um, Ooh. the Fortrex. Is that a mock? No, this is a set. This is what I built on on Monday. Here. You want want this? Okay, here. You want a kiss? This is the Fortrex. I think it's time for a nap. But we're not there yet. And this is a Lego set with cool wheels like this. The honor of Gray Skull. The honor of Gray Skull. Oh, Nick, he wants to pee. That's right. I won't want pee. Yeah, maybe. I'm just holding it up like one of those Bob Barker girls from. Oh, I don't dangerous. think I want to go out today, except for groceries later. Are we going to go out today? I thought we were going to pokey hunt. Are oh, we going to pokey hunt? I don't know. <laughs> so here's a feature here where. Did you do laundry? No, not yet. Where you can turn the knob and Ooh. then the drawbridge comes down. Oh, at the same time. Oh, no, it doesn't. I thought I thought at the same time this would move, but it just moved because I shook it. Uh, what else? Oh, this if you turn this key here, it opens like so. And then oh, I broke it. And this opens like that. Oh. And so this is the um, Fortrex, the Fortress. Fortress for the next one, I, guys. So I'm not sure yet if we'll, we might keep this built for a while before we break it up, but and then if you press this down, the banana missile will fire out. Um, Harold said that I think he's saying I have to go pee. You or him? The baby. Oh. Something. Oh, 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 pee. Oh, 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 pee. Harold's practicing. I know you're good. You still know how to do baby talk. Interesting. <laughs> we can't even decipher sometimes what he says clearly. Um, Andrea says you have to catch them all. Which means Pokemon, right? Harold and I uh, have memorized Which means Pokemon, right? Yes. Have memorized the Pokemon Go song by Misha. Oh my god. You Justin know, showed it to me. You know Misha? This little Eastern European boy? He's I think he's from the Czech Republic. Sure. 
All I do is play Pokemon Go. No, that's you're about to say it's all I do is win, win, win. Yeah. <laughs> so here are the little minions. When did you build, Look, build this? When did you build on this? On Monday, remember I said I had a, a stream with Oh, Vero. you didn't even let Oh, they're so cute. I know, and then there's oh you know God. for the, the why are the ears up? I want to put the ears up because yeah. they're so cute. You know the oh my God, I love them. The Beatles Lego ideas. Yes, the same shape is the Jeremy guy. What? But he oh. looks like he's naked. Oh my God, he's so cute. But and it's the same Instagram mold, now. but it's brown. So these are from Next One Nights. Yeah. And they're just Rose minions. They're called. Oh my goodness, I don't know this show enough. They're called. Scurrier. Again, they and just scurriers. like that, Lego gets me back. They're scurriers. They're scurrier and the scurry. I love it. And Only have two? Have... Oh, that's not cute. But these are cute. And How do we, we get got more of these? A chef? Bricklink. But they look the same. They're just the two faces. Oh, I'm not sure. I am into smart. So. Well, then you might like the Jeremy uh, figure, the one with the troll face. Um, Andrea says, or Jeremy says, in third person, Jeremy is running the chat today, Nick. That's why there are too many spelling mistakes. <laughs> this one has a big happy smile. That I believe is this is smile. Aaron. Hey, Brick Dudes. Aaron, all decked out. In green, someone's favorite color. No, no, these are super cute. I'm in love again. I want all of what them. What about this? Do you like this book that you can open up? Ooh, a trans clear book with monster. It could be like, you know, that Harry, Pon Mo Harry Potter monster book, that thing that eats your hands. That's cute. <gasps> I'm going to Disney World in two weeks. I'm terrified. Jeremy and Andrea just came from. I know, that's amazing, the cruise, guys. The Disney cruise. Then you open this up. Mini, I mean, Mini Bricks is here. He knows all about this. We can't book. go to the to the cruise until all of our children are toilet trained. I mean, we could, but I choose not to. Because it's already water-based. <sighs> what? The water base. Mm -hmm. And then this is Axel, the big guy. See, and then when they asked him, hey, when did you get this set? He was like, a long time ago. A long ago. time ago. Ask Harold. Harold, didn't I get this long time? When I was building it? What does a long time ago mean? When I was mean? building it, Harold was like, didn't you get that a long time ago? And I was like, exactly. I have to wait to go. What if you guys have, what if you guys slide that kind of conversation subtly in all of your live stream? Didn't you get that long today? Exactly. Have you booked the, see, look, a long time ago. Have you booked, have you seen the book from the Disney? No, what's the book from the Disney castle? Hey, mini bricks. Yo. This blue guy is, I don't even know the names. No, have you seen the book from the Disney castle? Clay. Is there a book from the Disney Castle? No, oh, we're not. She, it's because she's in such a far step. She's bragging. <gasps> okay, so the the, the huge bragging. dilemma, which isn't really a dilemma, but it's a dilemma. When we go to Magic Kingdom, this trip, they have the Christmas spectacular evening fireworks, blah, 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 from 7 to midnight of certain days of the week, which is an additional fee to get in meaning how are they going to do it with the people in the morning do they just kick them out like cows because when i was little that was all included the fireworks yes so i don't want to go there in the morning and then only to be kicked out and miss out on the fireworks that i so deserve with my entry fee so we're just going to go into wednesday hmm. so that's why it's good that you weren't able to build uh pick do the mini build oh, okay because i don't have time to go through the mini builds yeah I have to tell Nick to build it faster. But it's a collab within him and... Uh... Oh, BrickTubers. Yeah, I forgot about that. BrickTubers was launched yesterday, October 22nd, on on um, Down Under Bricks' channel. Oh. He had a live stream. Oh. And oh. he was roasted. Oh. <laughs> they were bombing him with questions. But he was, he was good. He was able to stay on his toes. But... That, that launched yesterday. So there's a form where you can um, chat about Lego and a whole bunch of things. I've been pretty active on the forum. I've just been like a chat chattering butterfly. Forum. Forum. Mm -hmm. F-O-R-U-M. Okay, I thought you said forum. I, forum. A forum. Forum. <laughs> Nobody says 
Hey, did you write on the forum? Did you did you did you did you discuss anything in the forum? In the forum. But form <laughs> is like, did you fill out the forms? Did you fill out the forum? <laughs> um, I looked and I think there's like 30 members now or something like that. Or 30 something members on the forum. So there's different topics there. Oh, okay. Do you have, have you ever written on a forum before? Have I written on a form? Yeah, forum. <laughs> <laughs> no. There's a forum called um, Eurobricks. Oh. Have you ever heard of Eurobricks? Yes, I have. <laughs> and there's a forum. I think there's a forum, um, Reddit. <laughs> um, no more bricks. Is Reddit a forum? Reddit. Harold signed up on um, the forum as Adjuster Bricks. Why and the so, mock? So now there's like bricks no more. There's a brick adjuster and then there's Adjuster Bricks. And his first, I saw his first post, and it's like all like troll stuff. Like, there's like a question. Who's what's, doing the ban hammer on that one? What's your favorite CMF? And like he's naming like Chinese knockoffs and stuff like that. A forum. I'm for. <laughs> that's for Rin. I'm for. No, that's for a rum. Like rum. Like, oh. He doesn't I'm, drink. It doesn't make sense to him. I'm for Rin. Uh, rum. <laughs> So that's so that's cool. Give me back my little cute thing. Uh, all right, let's take a look at some news. <laughs> you can use. Oh, there's something that's cool that I just saw. You mean the Disney castle is now not as cool as this cool thing? There is a Disney princess big fig. <laughs> it's wrong. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Who would it be? I don't even know. It's for the that's new. Wrong. It's for the new Moana. Oh, big. oh the, there's a there's a guy. Wrong. There's a guy who play, who's played by the Rock. Yeah. Oh, so he's the big thing. Yeah, not the girl. Not, a... <laughs> not the Hawaiian girl. Oh, before we do oh, that. Oh my goodness, we went to the Disney store last night. Oh, you did? Did you buy anything? I forgot. I, I let things slip. What we we secretly did last night while you were having your I'm having a live stream. You guys are are, are you guys gonna be home tomorrow last night? Last night? Did you see the sales? They have a bunch of sales. At the Disney store. Oh, I thought you said at the Lego store. For some reason I thought you said Lego store. I don't know. Okay, yeah. Tell <laughs> so about, you're like, I don't care. Tell, Disney tell store. About your Disney store. No, all the Disney costumes are on sale for 10 off. Yeah. And he didn't want to go look look for a buzz woody, but there's no size two three. There's either infants. Oh, Harold or says like he, he wasn't trolling. He was serious about that. I thought he was trolling. Never mind. Okay, sorry. Uh, Disney two three. Uh, Disney two three. Anyways, there were all these dolls from the Moana. Oh, movie so that's movie. when is that? That movie's coming out in November. So I know. I think we have to watch it because I love movies that make me cry. But you know, I actually haven't even watched Finding Dory. Yo. Yeah, but Finding Dory is Pixar. This is. The like Disney, Frozen, Disney. right? Yeah. This is like Frozen style. It makes me cry lately. All the what was the last movie last year? Frozen. No, Frozen was like years ago um, now. Frozen was what Andrea. I was what was last year's Disney? Because there was Big Hero Six, so it was after Big Hero Six. Frozen, wasn't Fro wasn't Frozen? Frozen. I was like pregnant, like this, crying. Oh, I don't know. We're terrible now. Can we ourselves Disney fans? <laughs> <laughs> and she's not going to want to be our friend. Anymore. I know. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm Zootopia. So sorry. Zootopia was so cute. Zootopia. I love this. I was talking to Harold, yeah. and Andrea recommended Zootopia. And he was like, mm, Zootopia. It's so good. And then so he started watching Zootopia, and he was like, oh, What's this? But then uh, he he, put, he turned it off, and then he started watching it again later on. And now he loves Zootopia. Oh, Harold. It's like somebody loving, um, tell, tell them what? That movie. The main character is Tristan. Oh, um, Legends of the Fall. I'm like, I love Legends of the Fall when you're younger. It's like, what is this movie? They don't even know Legends of the Fall. They do. These are <laughs> I love it. Wow, you're gushing. <laughs> Have you seen Secret Life of Pets, which I know isn't Disney, but I it's haven't so watched cute still. That. But I still love Zootopia best. Oh my god, that made me cry too. What's wrong with me? So the first part is uh, Alan the Brick Fam. Well, this was first announced on. Um, on Bruce's channel, no. down, on, down on the bricks. See? The retiring sets for 2016. So they're going to so really, be... we didn't have to buy the opera house until like now. So the pet shop is retiring. The Sydney opera house. So 
If you guys don't know what <laughs> sets these are. How can they not know? The Pet Shop, the Sydney Opera House, which Downer says he's just, he's just going to unfortunately not get it. Even though he, he kind of, yeah, he's going to. Okay, botch it, huh? Yeah. How come? Just because of all the other sets to get. And so, yeah. But Ewok Village, like someone's favorite set is retiring. But you already have two of it, so really? I'm just saying. Um, the Ghostbusters, Lego Ideas, is retiring. That's soon. This year. So That's by... It's by like two years only, right? December. No, three, three. Two years yeah. now? By December, it's retiring. Oh, wow. The Big Bang Theory is retiring. Okay. Lego Ideas. Okay. Wally. Wally <laughs> is retiring. <laughs> Wally is retiring. The Ewok Village <laughs> is retiring. Wally. Doctor Who. Is Doctor Who is so retiring. So are you are you going to like are you doing this to go like see see I told you <laughs> I knew it was good when we bought it. The sand crawler. The sand crawler is retiring. Sand crawler. And those are the sets that are retiring. If you go to Down Under Bricks' channel, he has a video showing uh, sets in 2017. 2018, 2019, and 2020 that are retiring. And basically, um, Quickie Mart. What does he know? He got inside information, James Cookie Bricks. Um, James Cookie Bricks has information that, or he, that he gave to Down Under Bricks. And had this cool kids know from the Lego store. He knows. He has friends. Nick, <coughs> if we win millions of dollars in the lotto, can you just work at the Lego store? I thought about that. So in 2017, uh, the Quickie Mart is going to retire. The Simpsons House is going to retire, and some other sets I don't remember. But the big thing is 2018, where there's a bunch of modulars retiring. Parisian Restaurant, I think, is one of them. Well, technically, we have all of them already, minus the ones I'm that we never saying, got. I'm just okay. saying. But did you see the one that's coming out in January? We're not there yet. We're not there yet. Did you see it? Many times. I didn't show you. I did don't you know have to show me. Other people show me. Did you me. know it's 4,000 pieces? Did you know that it's expensive? I thought it was going to be over $400 since it's 4,000. But 4, it's 000. not. In the States, it's 279. Oh, my God. 4,000 oh pieces. God. 279. <laughs> but maybe it's like just a bunch of like one by ones. No, it's big. It's uh, it's basically three modulars. Do you? Yeah, but what if they're tiny? I'll show you the picture. I saw the picture. Oh, here's the big fig. Time out. Time out. What? Do you have enough space up there? You need to get rid of these. What do you mean? Like. I feel like we need to get rid of these. It's going to go in our bedroom. It's not going to go in our bedroom. <laughs> so here's the big fig, which is played by The Rock in this Disney Moana. What's he holding? What is that? A mallet. It doesn't look pretty. It does not look pretty. I feel like... What do you mean? It looks okay. okay. He has all these tattoos. I feel like... A tattoo... Sig fig. Bye, Max Piper. If you have a lot of sig figs, I mean, if you Bye, want a sig Alex fig Bridge. and you have a lot of tattoos, you can have that big fig as your okay, sig so fig. Okay, so Moana, they have these. It's are... a kind of sucky looking set, though. Look it at that. Does. Besides I mean, the minifigures, look at the set. I don't know about that big fig. I feel like when it's a superhero big fig, it looks cool. I don't know. I think that since they're going to start with this big fig, maybe they'll come out with like a Sully big fig for Monsters Inc. Well, that's cute. See, but I feel like as a person, like. What a about person... Mr. Incredible sig a big fig? No. That would be cool. With a big jaw. <gasps> I'm going to be an Incredible for Halloween at work. How? Because Marissa Finley ordered like 25 shirts. Are you going to then... be a, one of the girl or are you going to no, be a No, she's going to say Incredibles. Just an oh. eye. And then a mask. It's a fishing but hook. All it's a of them, fishing hook? all the shirts come in extra large or large. Oh, it sizes. is a fishing hook. It hooks like this. I thought it was like a lollipop or something or a popsicle. That's an Andrea answer right there. I thought it was like a popsicle or like a toothbrush for the dentist. But or yeah, or a scythe. It is a hook. A, uh, or um, something that you use in the North Pole. A hook. Hook. But it's so light. Could have been like gray. Yeah. Oh. So the gingerbread man's coming back. But do we have it already? Yeah, but... But is it the same color scheme? It's the same, but it, you can start making a gingerbread man army. Cookies. And how would you get this for free? If you spend $50 at the Lego store. And how big is it? What do you mean, how big is it? <laughs> <laughs> 
So here is the gingerbread man, free gingerbread man. If you spend over fifty dollars, however, however, if you spend another twenty five, you'll also get the calendar with the coupons. Those coupons. all in one go. So you spend seventy five anyways, you get the gingerbread and the calendar. Yes. So I was thinking uh, the pick a brick wall because they have the new elements. You can't get anything until November eight. Well, well, this is December twelfth. Good. December eight. December eight. This is Harold. Harold was like, uh, this was the whole the Disney uh, castle thing. What? For October. He's like, oh, it's October. Nick, um, you can get the castle now. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I have to wait till October 8th. Hopefully it doesn't sell out. Oh, Jeremy. Hey! Jeremy let me know yesterday that if you go to Lego Shop at Home and you look up Disney Castle, it now says it is out of stock until the end of the <laughs> So it's good that I got it. Hey, did you get X amount of points? Yep. And did you use it already? Nope. So maybe we should go to tomorrow when we drop our kid in Centennial because this race is until noon. We should go to Sherway Gardens. Are you listening to this? There's nothing I want though. It's not the, no. Don't you get those fifty percent off uh, dimension packs? Yeah, but there the the Slimer isn't there. Okay. Is the Slimer there? Oh, you didn't even go. You went to Disney Store. I thought you went to Lego so Store. Exciting. I thought he she went to Lego Store and picked up the Slimer. Listen, but Sherway Gardens is just down the road, and let's go look at Sporting Life for your glove. Mm. And I gotta return something in checkers. Okay, we'll see. Um, at the at Toys R Us right now, Lego Dimensions is twenty five percent off. <gasps> no coupon with calendar this year. I heard. Oh, I'm not getting calendar then. What's the point? I have all these we calendars. Don't, from we last don't year, even right? post it. He doesn't even let us put it on the walls because I make family calendars that are. We have to cheap. verify that, Ralph. The brick fan would know. Yeah. Um. Wait. What did you say about twenty percent? Blah blah blah. Oh, Lego Dimensions um, at Canadian Toys R Us is 25% no. off. However, I know it's eventually it's going to be 50% off. That's right. Off, so, so high five that you have that wisdom yeah. at this point. Because I'm like, yo, I'm going to Disney World. I'm going to spend money there. We're not going to spend any more money. So there's on no Lego. coupons with this? That's a, oh, yeah. There's not even like the... Usually underneath, it shows like the little things <gasps> there. Good joke. Whoa! I thought he was gonna swear, and he never swears. <laughs> but the cal but the monthly mini build is cool. Look at all the tiles you get Don't with the Christmas. By them rocks that they got. Christmas present. Okay. No. 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 It's nice. No. So that's the calendar. Um, that's the U wing. You know what the U stands for? United Horse Galactic. <laughs> That's what Harold calls it. Here's the U-wing, a.k.a. the ugly wing. Yay, so wait, if they call it ugly, that means it's no way going to land in our beautiful basement. Well, I was Lego. asking Harold what you minifigures know, came with it. We need to, like, dust our Lego. Why have you been seeing people in the comments saying, hey, you should... No, it's getting me itchy. So rumor has it that Rumors. next Easter, we might also get the um, bunny. Because this past Easter was the chicken suit guy. And then now for Christmas is the gingerbread man. And so it might be the bunny. And then Harold was saying that, I can't remember what the date, but we might get the gorilla. I think it was like the birthday of the gorilla of the New York Zoo or something. Bad baby pandas. Did you? Know Andrea loves that set. Which set? What set am I? The ugly. Oh, <laughs> 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 sorry, Andrea. <laughs> <laughs> oh no more bricks i was kidding i didn't mean ugly i mean unitedly beautiful oh no i think he was kidding about the gorilla oh what's that the vampire i, I didn't pick this up well it looks that it doesn't look like a vampire at all the you wing <laughs> the ugly wing <laughs> um okay we're not even at the modular yet because you're talking about gorillas. And I uglies. found out about the modular on Monday. We were during the we were during the live I stream. I found out about the modular like weeks ago. No, they only showed it on Monday. Uh -huh. So uh, Harold and I were on a live stream, and then someone in the chat was like, "Oh, did you guys see the modular yet?" We're like, what? What? So Harold was able to find it, and then we had it up there. So here are some for the box art of some of the superhero sets. So this one is Batgirl. Bat Jet Chase. Eh, the colors are okay. Not bad. What do you think? Being this is... Um, I, don't like, I, I don't like that whole line. I can't. Okay. I'm not. I think it's okay. And I like this little Pikachu thing. 
Let's see. Little, there's no Pikachu thing here. Let's see. No. Isn't it like this? No. What's cuter? This? So cute. Or look, the at, Pikachu. look at the little belly. It's like a little head and belly, no neck. And then it's you get so Batgirl cool. with orange hair. I'm and then I'll show you wings. that's a brick fan. Ellen the brick fan? Check, yeah. check the date. What I date? He put the modular on. No. He put it after. Six days ago. Yeah. Monday. But then we we knew about it. We knew about it like he, a week ago. We didn't. didn't. So this here is Harley Quinn to the rescue. Harley Quinn to the rescue. Box art. I like the Harley Quinn figure there with the plaid shirt. What do you think? I don't like this these sets. I don't. I don't. They're not Lego to me. Look, Norma Brick says the DC Princess series looks cool. No. Even the guy? No, the no. guy looks kind of like a... Yeah. What's his name? Steve something. I don't like them. I don't really like... I the, like my Lego figures. I don't like, like the guy. I like my Lego figures like this. All boys and girls like this. <laughs> With claw hands. With claw hands. Oh, Harold that says... That is Lego. You know how you're going to be um, the, Mr. the Incredibles? Yes. Harold's going to dress up for As Halloween Mrs. Incredible? Too. No, he's gonna be an exo knight with the with the claw hands. Oh, I don't think we're gonna have claw hands. It's Incredibles. No, he's gonna be a Lego person, oh. an exo knight with the claw hands. Right, Harold? What's Christine gonna be? <gasps> She's gonna be like the pregnant Lego. <laughs> <laughs> That's mean. <laughs> no, because it's small. Okay, uh, superhero high school. He said he's not. What? Um, superhero High School. And this is with Supergirl, Poison Ivy, and someone else. Not bad. No. It kind of looks like the Hall of Justice. Right? No. You don't even know how the Hall of Justice looks. So. I do. Okay. And the, Oh, and there's no picture. Oh, here it is, the back of the box. So this is a cool photo of Jamie. He's the guy who designed it with the modular here. And in the yes, back, these next and nights aren't minifigures. I just like them because they look cute. I want to know that they're like Oompa Loompas. Yeah, they look like Oompa Loompas. Oh my God, they need to make Ch Charlie Chocolate Factory like Oompa. sets. And they can make that. And that would be amazing. Like Who's the, whole... the guy who turns into the big purple ball? Yes. Well, wasn't scared, it a girl? That scared me. Wasn't it a girl who became purple? Oh, you're right. Well, but ball, in the newer Charlie, of the, you're thinking Willy Wonka. I'm thinking Charlie and Chocolate Factory. Isn't it this Willy no. Wonka and the Chocolate Factory? No, uh, the older one is with Gene Wilder, and the newer one with is with Johnny Depp. Oh, but isn't it the same story premise? It's different. The uh, the Oompa Loompas in the new one is just one guy. Um, what's his name? Deep Pack something. They're remaking Charlie and Chocolate Factory again. Again. So this here. If I zoom it up, you can see I know, these the guys assembly even square. Say Lego on anywhere. Oh, there it is. And the assembly square, I guess you get like a pretzel shop, or is that a bakery? You get a flower shop, and you get like a cafe here. And it's supposed to be like the blend of a whole bunch of different because it's a ten-year anniversary. That's why they're making a special one this year. So next year, it's going to be a letdown for everyone because it'll be like, oh, it's so small compared to the assembly square. But you get also. Uh, a... It doesn't look that big. It looks like it looks like as big as the Palace Cinema. Uh, where's... Or or this like it looks like as... okay, so it's bigger. Fine. It's yeah, look it how, like, look how it small like... the what, what had Grand two? What had two? It was like a a barber shop and something, right? Like it had a two. The detective's office. And the pet store, right? Where's the detective's office in that? Oh, right here, detective's office. Uh oh, screen toucher. Hey, our toy worlds. They're remaking Charlie. Oh, he said that already. Um, I don't know why I can't get the bigger picture. Here. Oh, here. So this is going to be 4,002 pieces. A whopping 4,002 pieces. And it's actually on a 32 by 32 base plate and a 16 by 32 base plate. Hmm. So two base plates. And, and this is January what? January what? First, but January 2nd for us, because um Lego stores closed January 1st. Really? What do you what piece do you think they used for that? Harold knew right away. The garbage thing. 
What did you do? I don't even play Lego, yo. I'm talking about this, the top here. Boom, just like that. You didn't know? Yeah. yeah. I like the the rose. Do you see, like the rose, how they made the rose? Yeah. There? That's nice. This. So what is it? It's just like. It's like a bakery, a flower shop, and a coffee shop. And that's, I like, I like whenever they do stuff like that. Yeah. She's talking about the, the, awning, the arch, awning. which is just like, little. but then inside they also have a dentist's office. Where's the chiropractic office? I don't know. They have a dentist's <laughs> office. They have, they have a baby. A dance so that's cute studio. that they have a baby. We get a baby this way instead of the other way. Yeah. Unless you already have the other way. No, it comes in the city set. I didn't pick it up. Yeah. Like we have a baby from the teen mom, but she, uh, the baby has a blue torso. This one has a white torso. Oh. The blue one looks better. It's very nice. And look, they have like a balding, uh, a balding. I hair know. Piece. This hair piece here, which is cool. The balding hair piece. Do you think it will be an early Disney release for VIP members? Do not even get him excited. That's gonna be your Christmas present. Early. Gonna be it won't be. I don't think it will be because collect. that's what in the video he said that it won't be. A, it won't be a Christmas gift, yo. He said it's gonna come out January first for everyone. That's what Jamie said. Don't shoot the messenger. I wonder how you become Jamie. Jamie, how did you become Jamie? Jamie's talented. I know. There's a cool photo where I can't find it. Where <gasps> you bought your Christmas present already? Oh, here's the photo. What is it? Oh, wait, are you allowed to say it? Who's talking? No more bricks. I bought my Christmas present. Oh. <laughs> I always buy my Christmas present. Is it the point that by the time Christmas rolls around, he's like, what do you want for Christmas? I'm like, nothing. Are you on bag 11 of your Christmas present? <laughs> so <laughs> there you get this printed tile. Oh, of, that is so cute. You get of a the set. Not this set, of the cafe corner. That's a great so question. Like, he's like holding Our his toy cafe world cafe. has a valid question. Funko Pop. No. One. Oh, Funko. Um, I have a question. It says our toy world. Is no. Tublug over? No, it's not. Tublug is still going on. I'm so confused too. Tublug is still around. Uh where am I? Where am I? And then we have Sonic the Hedgehog level pack. So there's this picture here with different characters from so Sonic the Hedgehog. So we might be getting more minifigures from Sonic the Hedgehog. But do you know these other characters? No, I didn't. I, I do, but I don't know their names. Like I just played Sonic the Hedgehog and, and I was just, I, I immersed myself, but I don't know their names. Yeah. I played with it and I like, I must get rings. I must get rings. Wow, I got lots of rings. I think these characters are new. I don't remember them from the this is, um, Sonic Sega. Hedgehog. Sega. And Quad Jumper. So this is a rumor. Too, it looks too. This is something I would get. Yeah, it looks too. Too. I know that's something you would get. Yeah. I like it. So they're saying that these are the sets that are coming out for. Uh, the summer of twenty, summer of twenty seventeen, we're gonna be getting um, two battle packs. Mm -hmm. um, one battle pack was from episode four to seven. Mm -hmm. Actually, both battle packs are from episode four to seven. Mm -hmm. Fifteen pounds. I'm not sure what that is in dollars. Uh, thirty. Let's just multiply everything pounds by two. Quad jumper. Mm -hmm. Sixty pounds. One twenty. Rebel hanger. No price. Uh, un, un, undetainable. <laughs> do you know what the Death Gang is from no. Episode 7? What do you think, Death Gang? Uh, someone who kills people. No, but we watched the movie. <laughs> Remember when um, Han Solo, they're in, the, they're in the Millennium Falcon and those gangs come out, uh, and then there's that creature with the... Uh, that. Um, Imperial Hover Tank. $12. 30 pounds. 60. Vader transformation. Am I supposed to say it's prices? Or just. <laughs> <laughs> There's going to be another calendar. No. 30 pounds. Nick, like now? No, in the summer of. You know how the ad yes, came out weird. in the summer? You can buy it. We actually have two advent calendars, right? Because you had that free giveaway. Don't forget that. Yes. 
and FreeMaker. Yeah. So that's an oh for Canadians, it's not in here for Canadians. <laughs> Next, uh, starting Friday, a Toys R Us for the whole week. You can get the A Wing if you spend twenty five dollars. Because for the longest time, I was like, oh, we don't get the because the states got the A Wing like last week or Is something. Is it like a poly bag? It's a poly. It's this thing. It's the pop. Oh, okay. It's the A Wing um, minifigure. So if you want to have like an A Wing minifigure <gasps> army, but they come with the weird looking helmets. But that's that. What? <laughs> Nick is just warning you how much money he's going to be spending this coming months by talking to you about. I was already thinking, well, there goes my Christmas present that I want. I think Carol's Christmas present is. A baby. Did you see his new figure he got? He's not collecting Lego anymore. He's collecting figures, Star Wars figures. Mm -hmm. Episode 7 Star Wars figures that, are, that look like samurais. So he has a Boba Fett. What do you think? Um, are we going to move away from this now? No, I'm not interested in it. Look at all those Chima characters. What are we going to do when you like... Cha -cha -cha Chima. Okay, so we're past the hour mark. Way past the hour mark. Where did you put my baby? Is he howling in his crib? No, he's taking a nap. So uh, next week, next Sunday... Something about next Sunday that's making me angry. Oh, have... it's the Halloween party at my mom's. And I have to attend some parents' meeting for Mason's communion. Like parents' meeting, 10 a.m. Parents' meeting. So when are we? So the Halloween thing's at 3. Mm -hmm. So you're doing the evening. 1 o'clock? 1 o'clock. No, but it's 3 till like Whenever. later. Well, you think he's going to be there? And he is, yeah. What, what's like later? What's later? What's, I, I don't know. You, you just said, Seven. why is it so later? Probably won't stay that long. The whole point why your mom didn't want it later was so she can probably say, bye, guys. Um, Carol says, yeah, my firstborn will be present. And the Shogun Darth Vader. Yes, and Pumpkin Catholic. says, the, I, the Ronin, it's Ronin, I'm not I'm not sure Samurai. if other Christian sectors have communions and confirmations. The Ronin Boba Fett looks dope. Harold, are you going to be a dad? He is that young thing. Yeah. Actually, yeah, I, I, went to, I went to Catholic school. Me too. And but in Canada, sure. in Canada, Catholic school is free. Did you? I think in the states, mm -hmm. Catholic school is considered private school. Mm -hmm. But here, Catholic school is like public school. It's weird. In yeah. Canada. The only thing you have to pay for is like super private schools, like the ones that cost thirty yeah. grand a year. Oh, we just spoiled it. Oh Our wait, was that a said, secret? Oh my God! Congrats, Harold. Sorry, Harold. When he comes out, and Harold's coming out. What? <laughs> I'm so confused. I'm so confused. <laughs> okay, so next week we, it might be around after you get back from the. Um, you mean you're not gonna come with me to this parent <laughs> meeting? It's for parents. Uh, no, it's not a secret. Okay, so thanks everyone for hanging out, and let me go see what people are in the. So thank you to no more bricks, Harold. Why is this thing I'm free. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Our toy world, pumpkin <laughs> bricks, brick dudes. Someone's crying. Did he escape his crib? No, that, so sound, that sounds like hate, uh, Mason. Uh, um, minifigure collector. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Wow, this is the most viewers we've had in a long time. I think it's because uh, of all the live streaming. You know, oh, okay, we might as well watch another one. Because you might not see him again. Port City, <laughs> Port City Bricks. I know, it's like the, the weekend of live streams, and then I go dark again. <gasps> dark. No, because we still have to finish the Disney castle. Um, Ralph Maybe the Brule. Dark yet. Ralph the Brule, thanks for coming in. And I saw, I remember Zany. Zany mm -hmm. was there. Zany, Max Piper, Alex Briggs. No, see, we don't see. Does Zany come for any of the live streams much? Because he has no, a baby. He, he hangs out with his baby. See, no more bricks. We're going to lose such touch of him bricks, by December. Brick Zom Brick Somniac and Mini Bricks. Every time I do you say something like that, I think of Kazomba. Is it Kazomba? When I say who? Oh, Brick Zomniac? Like that whole thing. Mason changed from crying to laughing. Um, I'm just going to press page up instead of scrolling. Yeah, dude. Uh, I think that's the same people are talking over and over. Kelly! Thanks for coming in, Kelly. And that is. All she wrote. Murder. 
Oh, uh, we didn't talk about um, that movie with Wolverine. Logan. You're the one who told me about Logan. Coming out March 2017. It looks so weird. I was telling I was telling Harold about that. I, did you see the mm. the Logan um, trailer? He's like, yeah, Christine told me to see it. I'm like, Maria told me to see it. Like, how does how does Christine and Maria both see the Logan trailer before us? How are me and Christine not more universally linked like you and Nick? I don't know. So yeah, the Logan. It's okay. Except I don't understand why girl. Professor X is still yeah. alive. Because isn't he still alive? No, I thought this was like in the future because Logan doesn't age. And so I thought I was wondering oh, why Oh, is Professor that what X... it was? But there was like hovercrafts? Yeah, I think it's like in the future. Like all the other X-Men are already passed away because Logan doesn't age. He just, okay. he's immortal, I think. Mm. See, look, let's talk about Logan, right? Meow. No, we, we got to go. So thanks, everyone, for tuning in. This is Nick and my voice kind of went high there. <laughs> This is Nick and Maria <laughs> signing off. Thanks for We're watching. We're doing wiggles thing. Uh, we are. See you guys in the next video. Bye. You know wiggles are that, right? Yeah, the wiggles. I didn't realize the wiggles do that.